All right, so we're gonna get started uh, cleaning uh, this wheel. First thing I'm gonna do when it runs on the wheel. Next, I'm gonna take my wheel cleaner. This is the Meguiar's Detailer Oil Purge Cleaner. Now it's going to liberally spray it down. Just like uh, in the engine cleaning video, this is one thing you want to do this before you clean the rest of your car. Because you don't want to get that dirt back on the car. Because you're going to get dirt on the car, and if it's fan bots are bad at it. You're going to. And that way you clean, that way you clean it off. Then. should sit for a little while. No more I'll let that sit on the wheel. I scrape out the tires. So I'm gonna do that first. This here, if, you, if I didn't say it, this is pretty much a firm, you want to use a firm Bristol Boss brush on the wheels, or the tires, I'm sorry, because that's what gets all the dirt, the dressing, and everything off your tires. This stuff's very hard to get off. Again here, I don't think you can see it's off camera, but I'm using a dual bucket method, which I will describe that in the, um, in the uh, car washing video. Now I'm going to take this is a soft, this is pretty much a board hair brush, it is. And I want to um, just scrub the face of the wheel here. Again here, like I described in my uh, deep cleaning wheel cleaning video, the purpose of using a brush to agitate all that dirt, get all that dirt off the wheel, because the brush isn't gonna get the dirt off the wheel. You're pretty much, you're agitating the cleaner into the wheel so the cleaner does the work. Even though this wheel is very, very dirty, it's coming off very easily. There's still a little bit of caked in dirt here that's hard to get off. But we can always touch some of that stuff up later. Now I'm going to show you my Daytona Speedmaster brush. This is a very efficient brush. I love this thing. You can get way in here and you clean the inside of the wheel. Very versatile brush. If you can see my engine cleaning video, you should check it out. Um, you can use this brush to get in like the deep parts of the engine that you can't get with a normal brush. I mean, it pretty much it squeezes in quarter inch areas, very tight, small areas. You can get in with it. You can pretty much go anywhere you want it. It's even bendable, so I mean, you can bend it around something if you need to bend around something. Dirty, so I'm just going to touch this twice here. Dunk it in my rinse bucket. Now, because I know this wheel is very dirty, I'm going to come back and touch up the face of the wheel again. <clears throat> just to get any dirt that uh, these guys are brushed up to the front, the face of the wheel here. Kind of sad, so I can probably get some more dirt out. After all that, then you're going to want to take uh, your fender wheel brush and uh, just scrub down the fender wheel. Pretty much the last thing you want to do, the last step involved. And you want to make sure you get it. After all that's done, I'm just gonna rinse off your wheel.
And that's pretty much it for cleaning your uh, wheels. I see uh, there's still a little bit of dirt there. I'll come back and I can uh, touch that up not by hand. There's no problem with that. Nothing a rag and two can't fix. Don't worry about that. But uh, 99%, that's a clean wheel. And uh, that's how you clean wheels.